All right, guys, today's Thursday and an update from the section three of the garden. Hey, isn't this really cool? So this is honeysuckle, Japanese honeysuckle. Isn't that beautiful? I have it all over the place around in my garden. That's a good thing to have. You know, I also have, I have some Japanese, Japanese rose or multi-floral rose. So, I have a climbing a tree. Really awesome. So I have this all over the place too. So, honeysuckle, Japanese rose. Here, look over here. This is really cool. I'm going to chop most of this down. Because it just gets in the way. But look at this. Isn't that beautiful? It's nice I could have that surrounding my garden. It looks beautiful. Now what's going on in the garden? What have I did? What have, well, I can't speak English. What have I been doing? So I created another row here. So that's for my uh, tomatoes. This will be a row of beets. And this is from Harris Seeds. And I'm using beet red ace for a beat so i'm gonna make that roll right now after i get done with you guys and let me uh here let me show you some of the tomatoes i have so i have been using some surround on my zucchini plants because i want to make sure they grow because every time the last three years every time i planted zucchini oh after the first load the animals just like terrorized them the raccoons and ground groundhogs so i'm putting this clay and it's called surround and it's all natural it's organic too and i just put them on my zucchini plants well anyway so i have the orange zinger there's a sun gold and a shovel in a way and there's a black cherry a great white another great white Dancing with the Smurfs. Oh, that's getting a little tilted. I didn't water them yesterday when I put them in. Not a good thing. When you plant your uh, your vegetables, make sure they're well watered. That's another one dancing with the Smurfs. This is buffalo steak. Lemon boy. Look how healthy. I'm so proud of myself. <laughs> the lemon boy. Black trifel, and my garden seeds are the best. I always had a lot of success with black trifel in New Jersey gardens. Looks like deer poop. Oh, and you can smell it too. It's definitely deer poop. Yellow pear. I know a little small right now, but once I trim these bushes a little bit, get some well water, they're gonna start to sprout. Pineapple tomato. Let me show you, let me get in here. Let me get in here. So I got a whole bunch of marigolds. And you notice that white powder, that is a surround. It's a clay. It's a clay. So the animals, they come and eat it. They don't die. But they taste it. They're like, hey, this is dirt. This is disgusting. So they don't eat it. And they're just like, okay, I'm out of here. Nothing good here. So what else do I have here? Carolina gold. Rutgers 250. I will also plant basil in between these rows too. So maybe another set of marigolds and a lot of basil. I love planting basil in my, my garden. So between the basil and marigolds, uh, come on and surround. These animals don't want to be do anything in here. Cherokee purple. Celebrity. Brandy wine. Look guys, I got a lot more to go. <laughs> Ramapo, which is a New Jersey tomato. Lots of big tomatoes in that sucker. Green zebra. Brandy wine. Now I got several purple boys. It's all for recommendation. So I've had the seeds. I just never, this is the first year growing purple boy. So um, hopefully they worked out. So the seeds looked out great. They look nice and green plants. 
are tilted, planted very deep, by the way. All these are planted extremely deep, right with the worms and leaves and straw and weeds. Another purple boy and another purple boy. Yellow cherry. And there's those guys. My zucchinis. Sweet 100. I better get my marigolds. I mean, my uh, basil starting to get planted. That's a yellow cherry. Purple boy. Oh no, this one's starting to look ugly. A big boy. You know what's interesting with this? ground well because i added tons of worms there's also tons of spiders and tons of ants there's a lot of life a lot of life going on there's gonna be a lot of fighting a lot of fighting in this family garden there's a grape i still gotta put post up over here indigo rose there's two indigo roses by the way there's two right there i gotta make another sign uh purple boy this is a Juliet. That's a grape. Another green zebra. And a Belgium giant. Wait, let me turn. So, I want to finish my tomatoes this week. And then I can start working on this section. The fence and all my freaking peppers. Oh, they need to find a home right away. Um... It's a lot of work there, guys. Lots of work. And a lot of work back there, too. Uh, animals living back there. A lot of stuff. A lot of stuff going on. Anyway, look at this Japanese rose. Look at that. Amazing. Beautiful and amazing. So, I'm going to go plant my beets right now. Then I'm going to go shower. It's get, starting to get really dark out here. But on, well, on Saturday, I'll start, I should, this whole Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. Because tomorrow, right after my other job, I'll be Ubering the rest of the night. And I'll be Ubering the next three days after. There is no Sunday fun day this week. It's Uber weekend. But I plan to get this whole section done. To put all my tomatoes in. Um, I expect about 100 tomatoes. So we'll see what happens. Summer should be summers around here, and if I don't have uh, space, I'll just put them in the back. But all those trees got to get trimmed down. I'm not going to be able to do that. I just want to get my rows done, and gradually I'll clean it up and put some potatoes or something in that section over there. Maybe more beans or cucumbers. So, anyway, everyone have a safe, safe weekend, and I want to update everybody until Saturday or Sunday. And uh, love you guys. Take care. Bye.